Hi, we are here at Atlantic Health Systems. Very excited to be with Dr. Neil Shaw, Hi. Uh, musco, musculoskeletal radiologist. And we're going to talk about the difference today between x-ray, MRI, ultrasound, all these different technologies and how you utilize them here uh, at the sports medicine department, Atlantic, Health, Atlantic Sports Health. Um, can you give us a little understanding, Dr. Shaw, about the difference in these technologies? Sure, Bill. So we're musculoskeletal radiologists. Um, we focus on the musculoskeletal system and we try to come up with diagnoses utilizing the different tools we have. So one of the more basic tools is x-ray. It's kind of what we all have seen. Um, it basically helps us understand uh, bony alignment, joint spaces, um, easily assessed for fractures. It's very easily available. Um, it's low cost, uses ionizing radiation, but we use very little amounts of that. And it's um, a straightforward test. And what's interesting about x-ray, I mean, it's just bone, right? I mean, you're really yeah, we're just- really only seeing bone. Just bone, so no soft tissue. Right. You know, and that's when people, I think sometimes, they get an x-ray, oh, it looks good. Well, that's just your bones, right? right? There's a lot of soft tissue in there. Now, more in-depth technologies that exactly. evaluate soft tissue, which you're gonna explain now. Yeah, so, um, other uh, tests we could use ultrasound. It's, um, it's 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 very easily available. It uses no ionizing radiation again, and um, we basically just put the probe on the patient. It sends out sound waves, and we get a picture back. And that picture can show us things like muscle, tendons, ligaments, uh, joint fluid, um, and we can get a lot of information. And another benefit of ultrasound is, it's being used at the same time while we're with the patient. So if the patient says, I hurt here, we can examine that area exactly. And say they have a certain complaint, it's dynamic. So if they have a complaint where only when they move the wrist a certain way, they have pain. We can examine tendons for subluxation or, or, or movement that they shouldn't have um, that you'd only see with ultrasound. You couldn't get that on any other imaging test because it's dynamic. And I, I feel the, uh, the technology in ultrasound has really accelerated from, from uh, what I see. I see doctors using their cell phone with ultrasound, and, yeah. and now ultrasound can actually look at the fascia, the, the connective tissue within the, the structure. So uh, it's really amazing the advancement that you're able to do that in real time. That's right, Bill. There's a lot of um, real-time information. Lots of uh, image resolution has gone up a lot. You know, it's not just this fuzzy black and white picture. Um, like one of those old TVs that we used to have. Um, we're getting a lot of high definition images on ultrasound. Um, another technology that's uh, very exciting for musculoskeletal system is MRI. We get really detailed information there and we can see things like menisci, labrum, um, really small structures that make a big difference in the performance of athletes. So if you have a labral tear and you're a throwing athlete, that can put you out for a long time. Um, and not knowing that that's the cause of your injury can be a big problem when someone's giving you physical therapy or, or kind of directing other treatments. So having the right diagnosis um, with an MRI uh, is very helpful. And what's great, uh, specifically here, it's all in one building. Yeah. You know, you're able to kind of come, see, meet with the doc and get these tests pretty much immediately. That's right. So the sports medicine team here is very good at um, kind of assessing, triaging, figuring out what needs to be done, and then just kind of aligning up the tests that need to be done. Uh, we have a great way of communicating with each other, too, through the electronic medical records, so when we're interpreting the images, we can do all that. Um, the MRI is a large magnet. Uh, it's a very, very powerful magnet, and it's a uh, you know, longer test, but then you get a lot more information. Yeah. What's great is I've been through all three of those tests. Okay. Uh, actually, here, by the way, I'm an active you know, uh, adult athlete, but it's, it's really, truly incredible. I uh, can't thank you enough for the explanation of these technologies, and I know we're going to go into a little bit more depth on when they're used, for what types of injuries, but uh, for now, that was awesome, and we really appreciate it, and uh, we're going to come back with more info. Great. Thanks Thank for having me. Yep, thank you.